Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today's video we have a mystery bag, technically, or box. I don't know, I'm gonna title this yet. It's from Control Freak. Now I did have to buy this on my own, so it's not a sponsored video. So without further ado, this retails for about $25 on their website, but the links are in the description for what I have in here. So if you wanna purchase anything that I have in here, which I don't know what I have, then you can go ahead and do that. The only thing I took out was the billing. All right, let's get into it. So this is like a $40 value, I believe it said. Okay, so we have the precision rings. Looks like we have two of them. I actually did want to try these out and I might do like a B-roll or at the end of the video of testing them out. But basically they're just foam that goes on your controller, your analog sticks. Let's go ahead and open it. All right, wow, 12 bucks for this, four rings. Pretty interesting. So yeah, they're literally just foam. All right, we'll uh, test these out in a bit. Oh, okay, so we have the, yeah, these are the Xbox Series X version. They also have a PlayStation version. These are the Sniper FPS. It, oh, that feels good. High raised for FPS, it has a 120% increase of range of motion. Fastest you can get, and there's both of them, so they're both high rise. So yeah. This one is probably around a $15 to $17 value. Test them out later. And it looks like we have the Omni. Wow. I actually wanted these. These are the red ones, so that's pretty cool. They're both low rise. Yeah, they're both low rise. So these are the basically the just grip, just a small amount of raisivity. The reason why I wanted these is because the controller I have customized is also red, and I wanted something to go good with it, so. This perfectly fits like that. Here, come back and get 15% off, and it is a sticker, so you can go ahead and use that little control freak thing here. It says peel here, and use KF Nation for 15% off. And then on the back, you have just some information on checking them out on social. So yeah, that is the total, $24.99. Recap of what we got, we got the Omni Sniper as well as the precision rings which honestly i hope these work because they're kind of overpriced so these are the main ones i'm interested in i know regular control freaks for your analog sticks work perfectly but for these that go underneath them it says it helps with accuracy and customized precision so this one it has medium as well as hard so here's the omni control freaks really nice pattern i really like those like I said, they are a low rise, so so these are both high rise. I like the look to them. I'm gonna have to get a green controller soon to match it. A military green and a chestnut brown. I like the design to them look. It's basically just a scope, really cool. We're gonna apply these ones on. It's a different shade of red, but it'll still go good. I think that looks nice, really clean. By the way, if you wanna see this video on how to customize your Xbox Series S or X controller, it'll be popping up right now. These ones have the Control Freak FPS Galaxy and some grip around it. And we're gonna find another controller to put these ones on. I think this one would go good with the green because there's a little hint of green down there. This one currently has the FPS Edge, really old because I had it for about four or five years. All right, let's apply this. Boom, they're both high rise, so. Well, you get a lot of motion out of this one, I could feel it. I think the FPS Galaxy is a mid and high rise. And this, this one's perfect. That's how I like them. This one is just basically grip, the low rise, just a little bit more surface coverage. This one, I really like this one. I like the right one. So I could basically use two right ones for this or a low rise. I can mix them up however I want, but I like, I personally like this one a lot. Definitely would be good for quick action. If you're gonna be doing 360 no scopes or whatever, and these ones have the trigger stops as well. This Bionic Quick Shot does not work on the Series X controllers, sadly, and hopefully they do make some new ones for it. Now we're gonna go and try out the precision rings. So this is what they look like. They're pretty simple. Okay, I believe that is on correct, if I'm not wrong. And wow, okay, it feels really, they're very limited. It basically makes it, I don't know how the, I'm gonna have to test it a lot, obviously, but Definitely feels weird. It's like a big chunk of analog stick. Let's go ahead and try the black one now. We're gonna put it on this one. 
All right, so this one is basically on. Wow, okay, this one's like way more resistance to be, but it feels so weird. I don't know if I'm gonna get used to that. Definitely start on the medium first, and then once you get used to it, go switch to the hard version, and that will improve even better. Interesting. And if I do update this video, then I will add that B-roll or whatever in to be able to show you guys that it works or it doesn't. If someone at Control Freak or anyone else that has gamer equipment or anything, if you want me to test out your product or send me something over to review, let me know and I can do that for you. So thank you guys for watching. If you are new here, make sure you subscribe. It only takes five seconds to do so and it's free. Without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.